Hello friends, welcome to my next video tutorial of SketchUp Pro 2017 and in this video tutorial series, I'm gonna show you how to use SketchUp Pro and watching all this video of this series, you will learn how to use SketchUp Pro. To start with this video, I'm just giving an introduction of SketchUp Pro. Click on the SketchUp Pro 2017 icon on your computer screen, double click on this and you will see this type of window appears here the first one is learn you can see going to learn you can check here 3d warehouse and about the buy sketchup pro and some other thing and going to going to license you can see here some requirement for license and going to template you can see here different template usually we use the first one which is inches mean feet and inches and the next one is meters if you meter and you can see next millimeters unit you can use anyone and you can select any template to start just i'm selecting first one to start and click here start using sketchup and when it opens you can see this type of window and this is the coordinate the origin of this 3d and you know this is a three-dimensional program which uh, sketchup pro is a three-dimensional program and this is the axis you can see here there are three axes one is red which is x the green which is y and the blue is the z axis and you can draw anything three dimensional here and from the top you can see here this is the title bar when you save the drawing with the name the name appears here if you go to your file and save then if you write a name then you can see here the tutorial zero on them appears here and the next are the menu bar you can see here file edit view camera and lots of menu bar here going to is menu bar you can see lots of option here going to file you can see creating new file open file save as save as 3d warehouse export import print print preview etc and you can also see at the bottom there is a recent document list you have just worked and going to edit you can undo redo and copy paste and some other option here going to view uh, you can see there are some view shadow fog if you check this fog you don't see any uh, sky background in the back side and if you draw any rectangle and go to view if you click shadow you can see here the shadow so check uncheck this fog and then camera you can see as some other option camera zoom orbit something then going to draw you can draw some object from here and also going to view you can see here the toolbar option lots of toolbar here i have only get started toolbar if you uncheck this one you can see there is no toolbar you can check various toolbar if you want and usually i recommend to use the last tool sets and close all the toolbar are here and going to tools you can see there are some other option select move rotate text dimension etc and going to in window you can access to some other option the first if you go to model info then you can see here various option here the dimension going to dimension you can change the dimension font style and text size the font style you can see here the font also font name this text type etc and going to text you can also change the parameter from here the arrows arrow arrow type font style font dimension style the arrow style you see i'm going to unit you can change at the unit you can see here currently we are in architecture which is in speed if you want to change right now you can also change from here uh, architecture to decimal but we are just keeping this architecture right now and going to window and preference you can also set some parameter from here going to accessibility you can change the axis color you can see here the red axis green axis and blue axis if you want to change this you can change from here and going to general you can change the auto save mode if you want to to turn off this auto save mode un uncheck this one and if you and to increase the time or decrease the time you can change from here it is now in five minute interval you can change from here and going to template you can set here any def default template if you want to currently we are in feet and inches template if you want to set this one then you can select this one if you want to change this uh, then you can select this one but just i'm keeping this one so these are the setting from here 
so this is all about the introduction of SketchUp Pro and from the next video I will show you how to work using SketchUp Pro 2017 thanks for watching my this video if you like this video subscribe my channel see you in any next video